Is she in? She told me to tell you to fuck off. <sighs> come on, this isn't high school. Yeah, and it isn't first year either. Oh, come on, please. No. Just let me. Cat, Emmy. please. I really need no, to don't do it. Please, right? Cat. Look! He's allowed to go through. <sighs> okay. 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 Emmy! Hearing it twice won't hurt. What are you doing here? You're not allowed to be mad at me after what happened last night. I was having a sig. For two hours? It wasn't two hours. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, okay. Forward in the dark. Yeah. You knew just while my soul Nah. You're right. She's outside. Who? Your girlfriend. Good. What? It's not a litter or anything, is it? Still. You're not moving me, are you? No. Me and Gunner back together. Oh god, really? Yeah, over the summer. We're tired again. It's not like we were, kind of. It's just, you know, nice to have the security. Okay. I don't really care, but thanks. Wait, listen. Just because you're all interested in tatters, don't take it out on me. Alright, no doubts, no problems, Dan. We haven't got any problems. Well, Cal hasn't, but you have. You know what? Fuck you. It was two hours. So that's it? That's why you're mad at me? No, okay. I'm mad at you because you always do this. Every time I organise for us to do something, you sod off before it gets good. I don't remember having a good time. I remember us sneaking off upstairs and then you disappeared to play beer pong when Taylor interrupted. Because I don't want to get off with you in front of all our friends, okay? Don't be dumb. I'm not being dumb, okay? I just like my privacy. No, you're scared to be with me in public. No. Okay, fine. What do you want me to say? I have never had a relationship with a girl before. It's just a bit... Weird? No, no. It's just... It just takes a minute when you've grown up with straight being the only option. You've just got... Got all these resources when you're straight, you know. Resources? Come on, Dan, don't be difficult. Just pick one. What, to read? No, a film. Oh, right, yeah, sorry. Do you think they're gonna break up? It doesn't matter, just pick one. Do you know what, Kick-Ass? I can't enjoy myself without reporting back. I can't breathe without an explanation. Well, I can't be with you when you... You're never fully with me. Okay. So I crowd you, but then I also don't crowd you. You make up your mind. You're never with me. It's like I'm your security. Like something else in your mind, like a backup. Okay. 
That was you last night. You don't be embarrassing. Embarrassing? You won't kiss me in public. Because public displays of affection are gross. And you know I'm a private person. Fine, you're private. I'm proud. No, don't say that, okay? I am proud. So what's that name? Who? Your side piece. Cam's right. Oh my god. Okay, first, Cam's just being insecure about her own relationship. Maybe, but it would make sense. So who is my side piece then? You tell me. No, no, if you've gone to such lengths to think of an elaborate cheating plot, then I want to know who I'm with. I know you're with me, Emmy, but that doesn't mean you don't like guys. Don't walk away. Fine, let's talk about this. Let's talk about you and Dylan, you and Hassan, you and... Okay, okay. You and Dan. Me and Dan? What are you on? What was all that racket last night in the kitchen? Hi. Hi. Uh, listen, I... You don't need to apologise. It was just Natoka and, and we were both asshole. I wasn't going to apologise. Should I want to apologise? No, it's fine. What do you want to say then? Well, it's just the... Talk. Hey, Bob. Hey. How's the morning? Uh, Stevenson grilled me. What about the bike incident? No, about the essay. What essay? Just a critical analysis of this philosophical concept. Yeah, it's a bit dry to be honest. I won't bore you with it. Yeah, it does sound a little bit dull. Yeah, you probably understand it anyway. Anyway, I've got to go study, so I'll see you all later. Listen, do you think later we could go over the Stevenson notes together? Uh... You know, the ones about deception. Oh, right. Um, well, I'm a bit busy. Um, but, um, I I've got some free time tomorrow after the RGBT meeting. Uh, maybe outside the chapel to see if I have to warn. Yeah, that's brilliant. Right, see you then. Well, how? Oh, that. Oh, well, <laughs> my housemate oh. went out and then they oh, lost him at some point during the night. Uh -huh. And then you can see the next day. Yeah. We were all like, so how was your night out? Because that wasn't there. Well, and they were like, well, we haven't seen it. Well, yeah. uh, <laughs> since when? Since always. Well, yeah, but. Takes a minute, doesn't it? Listen, I know me and you didn't end on the best of terms at sick bomb, but please, don't out me. Jesus Christ, I got outed by Trump in training Mark Jenkins, okay? I would never. What does Cam say? She doesn't know? She'd think she turned me or something. You're not a fucking vampire, Dan, all right? Give us some credit. We're awful people. This does not make you a bad person. <laughs> no, no, no. We're awful people. How am I a bad person? You've been lying to G. No, I haven't. Oh, so you're not sleeping around then? Who told you that? Cam. Cam. Right. So you know? No. No. Oh, what? I just thought you two were exclusive is all. What makes you think that? Listen, that doesn't matter now. All that matters is that no one I know finds out about this. Okay. But only because I had no one. Thank you. No. How do we get out of here? Just use the door, mate. No one gives a shit. But... What's with this drug dealer attitude? Okay, there's nothing criminal going on here. Yeah. Maybe you're right. I've been there, done that, worn the straight jacket. Okay? There's no need for it. You really had no one, did you? Yeah. I'll tell her tonight. Do you still want to go over the notes? What? Oh, no, I just made that up to get you here. Oh, okay. Great. Well, then can I have your notes? Because I wasn't paying attention. Seriously? Tits up. What did you do? Nothing. She just went dead silent again. Are you two done for good now? Whoa, no. No, 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 of course not. Well, what did she say? I started talking, she ignored me, and then... And then? 
Then I went to the toilet and left. Okay. I'm sorry. Anyway, how are you and G? Well done. Text her this morning saying I had a test. <laughs> mm. Listen. I've decided against telling Cam. Why? I told G I was gay, it was fine. But that's different. You're both girls. That's like the definition of gay. Okay. First, I'm pansexual. So, it's not really girls, girls, girls. It's more like people, people, people. If you get me. Regardless. It would be weird if I broke over. Mm, yeah, because it'd be normal if you keep her as your beard. <sighs> Can you just chush, please? Oh, fine, yeah. Why don't you tell the Captain America and Bucky are your OTP? In fact, why don't you tell her about how attractive all the Avengers are? Well, for you, that's anyone who's male, which makes what? 20 out of 22? The lack of women is a whole other problem. And, like, what is vision? Focus, please. I'm not telling her I'm gay. Okay. Anyway, you know what Cam's like. We've been tight since year 10. I, I couldn't do it to her. Well, I mean, you dated me in sixth form. <laughs> Fine, we're not solid. But why do I have to tell everyone? My mum, my dad. Could you imagine what he'd say? Uh, not fun. <sighs> what have I got myself into? Whoa, okay. Take a breath. <laughs> my, my last. Breathe. Not everyone needs to know. What are you on about? You're always talking about it. I thought we were meant to be proud. You're not meant to be anything. Like, I'd encourage you to tell most people. That way you weed out who really cares about you. You know, that being said, you, you kind of clock people straight away. You know, if, if people make you feel insecure in your own skin, drop them. Like, it's their fault for assuming you were straight. I mean, I did until we dated. You knew? Before I did? Mm, yeah, it was obvious. And not just because you dumped me in the first five minutes. Funny. Ugh, well, you have to get your pride outfit sorted soon. What? When you're ready. I can't see. Is it a requirement? Well, no. Just, you know, just a bit of fun. You get to put on glitter, don a flag with your fellow gays. But I don't want anything about pride. You don't like it? <laughs> don't, that's all. Well, I like it. It's cool, all right? <laughs> How was your day? Fine. And what about Stevenson beef? There is no Stevenson beef. Everything's fine. Are you going to be moody all evening? You're going to be rude all evening. Are you not mumble? We're going to speak up a little bit. I said you're going to be rude all evening. Listen, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to do that. What are we, Cal? Well, we're together because I love you, you idiot, even with your stupid fashion choices. There's nothing dumb about my outfit choices, Cam. What's dumb is that we're still doing this. I thought we talked about this last year. Yeah, we did. You're right. Year 10 and year 11, we were great. But that was it. Well, so you've been miserable since then? No. No, of course not. It's just... I've come to my senses, sort of. Sort of? Like, sort of like, you should have been honest since the start of the relationship? But what do you want me to do, Cam? Oh yeah, hey, I know we've only been on two dates, but I wanted to let you know that we've got no future whatsoever. Yeah, well that's what we're doing now, isn't it? Only with a few wasted months in between. You can't go around planning our futures together for years. That is how relationships work. It's not how relationships work at all. Why do I always have to explain these things to you like you're from a different planet? Isn't it simple? We talk to each other, we communicate. When did you ever communicate to me that we're going to last beyond university? What, what about in everything that I do? Alright. I shouldn't have. What is with you? Nothing's been the same since we started uni. Nothing's changed. I'm not mad. I'm not. Just talk to me, please. Maybe we should just think about it. I want to think about it. Shouldn't be this hard. Thanks for
recording. Oh shit. I knew there was something I should have done. I'm sorry. I really needed to talk to you. Oh well, I'm here now. What do you want to talk about? Well, I was just doing my work yesterday and I just realised like we've been going out like a year and a half and there's still so many things we didn't know about each other. <laughs> okay, um bit out of nowhere but just forget it. No Alright, um Well what's your biggest fear? My biggest fear. Um yeah. I guess it's drowning. You're on the swimming team. Yeah, but I think that's part of the reason I fear it. Like, endless drowning. Okay, so, um, so like, you're immortal and uh, you're drowning, but you can't die. So, like a mutant or uh, a wolverine from Days of Future Past with uh, out all the metal pipes and shit. Oh, come on, please stop. I went off topic. Sorry. Come on, it's... Imagine choking, not being able to breathe, and it's it gets darker the further you go down, and you can see the light a way out, but no one can see you just drowning without dying. Endless drowning. Just swim, maybe? Now's the part where you tell me your biggest fear. Nah, nah, I'm good. What? What are you doing? It's just paper. <sighs> Alright, you're a proper savage lad, aren't you? What the fuck? Oh, shut up. It's smoking. <laughs> it's not just smoking though, is it? Here comes the lecture about my degrading body and weakened chakra. Why are you even doing it? Is it to avoid me? Oh, great. Okay. I just figured it out. And fine, make fun of me for giving a shit. Hi. Sorry, again. It's not your fault, trust me. I just... I tried to be that person, you know, super chill, one of the lads. But that's just not me, it's not. Calm. Don't. Calm. I just wish you'd talk to me more. You never open up anymore. I've been, uh, doing a lot of thinking. Well, over the past few months and... Actually, wait, let me, let me start again. You're in love with her? <laughs> no. Well, you are, because you know who I'm talking about. I'm really not, I promise. Well, how can I believe you when you... Calm, I'm gay. I meant to tell you. I wasn't sure myself. So I went to this LGBT meeting at uni to try and talk myself out of it. After that night, I was going to come here and I was going to tell you because I knew. But Amy spooked me. I'd only just come out as gay to myself. And I was expected to tell everyone. I just couldn't do it. I'm sorry, Cam. Please, just, just don't hate me. I'm not mad. What? I'm not. You've been going through this alone? Yeah. Apart from Emmy. Well, that spends everything in the kitchen then. And all those late nights in the library. God, I had waking nightmares where I caught the two of you going at it in one of the pods. I think of it, you wouldn't even be able to do that in the library. No. Too much glass. Cam, I'm sorry I misled you for so long. I just didn't know what to do. At least... At least you had Emmy. You should leave. Or maybe I should leave. I'm vacant minded anyway. You can't leave, it's your own house. We're overreacting, okay? Let's just skip the crappy fight and get dinner. All of this is crap. Okay. I'm going home at the weekend, and when I come back, I'll decide. 
Decide what? I'll drop your stuff off in the morning. Why do you have to be so over dramatic about everything? I don't think I love you anymore, Emmy. And trying to is too hard. What? I heard you. Sorry, I didn't... I... Fuck you! I don't love you either! Don't joke, I can't tell if you mean it. Well, that's our relationship, isn't it? It's a fucking joke. And I hope you do fucking drown! You don't need her. Don't be cringy, Dan. Well, good to know your opinion of me is as high as ever. When's Pride? June. Right, we've been over this. We need to get costumes. It's a few months away, okay? I think we'll be fine. I usually just print off a picture of a frying pan and stick it to my chest. Oh, right. Okay, we'll do it next week. <laughs> you know what? I'll do you one better. We should start our own parade. Have our own little parade. Where are we going to have a parade? Outside. You don't have to prove anything, okay? And it's freezing. Oh, it's always cold. Get over it. I can see it in your face if you're interested. Not in the slightest, mate. Come on. God, it's freezing. Freeze my fucking tits off. I wish you'd go. <laughs> don't break on a parade. You don't need to make a musical theatre joke, okay? I think they get what we're putting down. 